In the vast realm of the insect kingdom, honeybees have always held a special place in our hearts and ecosystem. They not only gift us with sweet honey but play a pivotal role in pollinating plants, which in turn sustains the life cycle of countless other species. But there's an aspect of the honeybee that has always intrigued many. What exactly happens to a honeybee after it stings? Let's dive deeper. You might have heard that honeybees sting as an act of self-defense, and in doing so, they pay the ultimate price. But let's break down the science of it. When a honeybee decides to sting, it uses its stinger, which is a modified egg-laying tool known as an ovipositor. This stinger punctures the skin of its target, injecting a venomous concoction called apotoxin. This venom contains a mix of compounds, most notably histamine and melatonin. The aftermath? A bee can live anywhere from 5 to 24 hours post-sting. And if you've ever been tempted to swat at a bee, think again. Doing so releases pheromones that could attract more bees to the scene. The pain you feel from a bee sting is not just due to the venom but because of the bee's barbed stinger. This stinger gets embedded in the skin and when the bee tries to fly away, it leaves behind not just the stinger but also parts of its digestive tract, reproductive organs, and muscles. It's a process called autotomy, and it's a fatal sacrifice for the bee. Let's pause for a moment and consider the average bee's lifespan. It might surprise you to know that the hard-working worker bee has an average lifespan of just six weeks. In stark contrast, the queen bee reigns supreme for up to five years. But life isn't always a bed of roses, or a hive of honey, for bees. Predators, environmental hazards, and yes, the act of stinging, can cut their lives short. So, when you come across a bee, always treat it with kindness and respect. Now, you might be wondering, how can one avoid the dreaded bee sting? Here are some pro tips. Opt for light-colored clothing. Bees are generally more attracted to dark shades. Steer clear of perfumes or strong fragrances. A bee's keen sense of smell can mistake it for a flower. Stay aware of your surroundings. If you notice bees buzzing around a particular area, give them their space. And most importantly, resist the urge to swat. A calm demeanor is less likely to provoke a bee. To wrap it up, while the life of a bee that stings is tragically cut short, its sacrifice is a testament to the intricate balance of nature. So the next time you find yourself in the company of these buzzing wonders, remember their vital role in our ecosystem and always approach with care and appreciation. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the content and found it valuable, please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. It truly helps us out and ensures you don't miss out on more insightful content in the future. Your support means the world to us.